Hello and welcome to the roundup of this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 27 August 2021. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly publishing editor Martin Kremer explains that the important link between South Africa's mining industry and its public capital markets is broken. With South Africa needing more listings on its stock exchanges, what can be done to encourage companies in general and junior mining companies in particular to go public? One suggestion is to take advantage of secondary listings. The engineering news features focus on gas, with hydrogen being seen as a suitable greener alternative to support decarbonisation. Women in industry, where free courses for women promote involvement and laser technology, where a specialist company offers laser cladding services to industry. The Mining Weekly features focus on energy solutions for mining, where microgeneration is seen as the future of green stable power, and analytical services and geology, where real-time ore analysis is set for the African markets. This week's business leader is Tabia Malachi, partner professional services firm EY. And as this week's cartoon shows, vaccine hesitancy is a major concern, especially from an economic perspective. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly, the magazine that offers you news about developments in the real economy. Happy reading and see you next time. Thank you.